When a developer renames an ID or class, that small DOM tweak can silently break your automated test by invalidating their locators. Even though the feature itself still works, the false negatives that follow flood your CI-CD pipeline with red builds, pushing releases back and creating unnecessary stress. Broken locators sit at the heart of this issue. Each time a selector stops matching, QA engineers must sift through logs, triage false alarms, and rewrite locators. An exhausting cycle that slows test runs and drives maintenance costs up. Introducing Browser Stack's self-healing AI agent in Automate. It automatically identifies and resolves locator failures at runtime, significantly reducing test flakiness. Let's see this in action by comparing tests without and with self-healing enabled. On the left, you see the original login page. On the right, after a UI update, the username field and its underlying selector have changed. Now let's run the automated test without self-healing enabled. Scrolling down the logs, we see the test has failed with the error, element not found with selector input hash username. Next, let's run the same test again, this time with self-healing enabled. As you can see, the test passes successfully. Let's scroll up the logs to understand what happened. Notice the healed selector log entry. Clicking it reveals that number username was the original selector. When the test couldn't find it, Browser Stack's advanced self-healing AI agent automatically identified the best alternative selector, ensuring the test continued smoothly. And that's how the self-healing AI agent delivers improved test stability, faster debugging, and significant time savings for your QA team. Enable Browser Stack's self-healing AI agent today and let your tests automatically adapt to UI changes.